Achieving the new normal for manufacturing sites with MELSEC IQR. Introduction of a method for identifying defects using a database of accumulated production data. Chapter 1. Use Case. What do you do when defective products are suddenly discovered prior to getting shipped? There are cases where, as deadlines approach, all products in stock are inspected, or large amounts of data extracted from equipment are steadily checked using a PC. Methods utilizing databases to solve such problems are becoming more common in manufacturing sites. A database refers to a specialized system for centralized management of large amounts of data. Such systems are used whenever large amounts of data need to be processed, for example, for train seat reservations, EC websites, etc. When utilizing such a database at a manufacturing site, at beginning, equipment, production dates, time, type, and sensor values are accumulated. Then, the data at the time which the defect occurred can be efficiently checked by extracting necessary data into familiar software, such as Excel, etc., and graphing it. This video explains an example of a small start by adding an MES interface module to a MELSIC IQR PLC for sending slash receiving device data and linking equipment to a database. Applicable equipment is simple inspection equipment that checks the dimensions and weight of plastic blocks. Until a few years ago, quality control was performed by sampling inspection of products that had passed through the inspection equipment and inputting the actual dimensions and weight into a PC. Then, from a year ago, as a measure to prevent the leakage of defects due to deficiencies in the inspection process or equipment, the operation of extracting all the inspection data judged by the PLC as an Excel file to a personal computer was started. However, the sheer volume of inspection data created a new problem. When a defective product actually occurred, analysis took a long time. So let's solve this problem by using an MES interface module and linking this equipment to a database. At first, the inspection data to be collected will be the minimum required data of dates time, type ID, dimensions, and weight used in PLC control. The judgment values for dimensions and weight for each type ID are registered in the inspection equipment, and the operator performs the inspection by inputting the ID. Ultimately, the goal is to create a screen like this in Excel so that specifying the type ID and dates time would narrow down the results from the vast amount of inspection data and allow dimensions and weight to be checked. Next, the specific procedure for small start will be explained. Please watch the next chapter, Hardware Preparations and GX Works 3 Settings.